गुड डे फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ स्टोरेजर अनिल अग्रवाल टूडे वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट द आर्टिकल विच हैज बीन पब्लिश इन द एक्सप्रेस स्टार टेलर इन द मे एडिशन बिटवीन द पेज टेंथ टू ट्वेल्थ विल द रूलिंग कोलिशन एन डी ए कम बैक टू पावर इन जनरल इलेक्शन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फोर यूजिंग द तमिल क्लासिक्स to analyze a prashna by eight methods by eight techniques so this article is published so i am discussing it here three eminent astrologers of the country have predicted uh, dr andrew datta then myself and another shri girish hegde all the three predict that the nda government will be back in power and narendra modi will hit a hat trick now <clears throat> my technique one technique one is from prashna and the prashna chart is of cancer lagna and it indicates the lagna lord in the 11th house exalted and in the nakshatra of rohini which is a upward looking so it is very progressive and uh, jupiter placed in the 10th house is as the ninth lord is forming a rajyog so i am not discussing everything but the uh, there is one constraint and that is the eighth house has um, 10th lord mars saturn and venus and uh, this shows that at the time of elections there could be espionage from foreign elements uh, the the uh, opposition may try to create a stir in the country and uh, fake videos have already been made of uh, amit shah and there was a bomb hoax in the 100 schools of delhi so this my prediction is absolutely correct and i predicted that since there were planets in the 8th house so there will be uh, such all this espionage and uh, Uh, still which will be created by the oppositions and the foreign elements now uh, technique 2 is kota chakra at the time of prashna according to the foundation chart of bjp of 6 april 1980 11:45 hours the kota <coughs> swami is mars and kota palak is moon and both are placed in uh, excellent conditions there are six planets out of nine which are in benefit condition and uh, out of 9 so if we calculate the percentage it is 66.66% and if we consider the 543 seats then the calculation shows that bjp the nda government uh, ruling government will again gain about 361 to 370 seats uh, technique 3 breadth of the astrologer the breadth on saturday is of suri nadi and good shows the longevity of the uh, present government and da tambula prashna tambula prashna uh, was used and the remainder comes to 2 and it indicates uh, uh, what do you call from sunday the second day is moon and the lord is exalted in the 11th house moon calculated in the prashna chart indicates domestic happiness mental peace among the units it is uh, signified by elephant and gains and achievement now then the technique 5 28 nakshatra met- method is andha the results will be positive but with difficulties and foreign elements and opposition parties will try to spoil the name of bjp and the prime minister nader modi technique 6 is kal chakra all the planets are placed in the uh kal chakra are extremely good except ketu technique 7 panch pakshi according to the panch pakshi the ruling planet for bjp the ruling bird for bjp is owl and is in eating condition and enjoying the fruits of the karma uh, from the uh, time 141 hours to 530 hours and the prashna uh, it falls in the prashna time which is extremely beneficial for the party now the technique 8 is ashtak mangala number uh, using the 108 uh, 
seashells and we pick up three bunches of seashells out of 108 and the number calculated is 255 and the center and the right number is Venus and uh, uh, and confirm the results the middle number also confirms that it is Sun and Sun is very good and uh, the present and the future is also depicted by Venus and it also shows the contribution of women in the 2024 elections. Uh, all these six parameters calculated from this number are positive and uh, all the eight techniques applied in the coordinating the Krishna chart are indicative of strong success by the ruling India government 2024. The planets at the eighth house of Krishna chart indicate hurdles, disturbances during elections which I have already predicted. So this is all friends I just wanted to share. Thank you very much for listening to me. Have a good day. Good luck. Bye bye.